Welcome to part two of the video on induction variations. My name is Professor Michael Polyuk. Let's look at one last example before we finish. Suppose that someone gives you a function from the integers to 0, 1 and tells you that for all integers, if f of x is 1, then f of x plus 3 is also 1. They also tell you the same thing for x and x plus 5. And to get you started, they tell you that f of 0 is 1. What other integers can you conclude must have f of x equals 1? Take a moment to compute this on your own. So by using the first property over and over, we get that since 0, f of 0 is 1, then f of 3 will be 1, and then f of 6 will be 1, and f of 9 will be 1. So we keep applying 1 over and over after applying 3. And same for the second one. You can keep applying uh, f of x plus 3. You plug in x equals 0, and then plug in x equals 5, and then plug in x equals 10. Now, this seems like there's going to be lots of gaps and lots of missing things. But it turns out that you can mix 1 and 2. So after applying 3, so, so putting 0 in the first one, then I can put uh, 5 into this and get that since f of 5 is 1, f of 8 will be 1. So by looking at all the different variations, you can get that 0, 3, 5, 6, 8, 9, and 10 all have a value of 1. And now something very special happens. So because these three are all in a row, then we can apply the first part over and over to get that the next block of three things will all be have a value of one. All right, this is three more than eight, three more than nine, three more than 13. And now from here on in, we're not going to have any gaps. So 14, 15, 16 will be three more than 11, 12, 13. And so in this way, everything from eight forward will have a value of one. Here are some exercises for you to practice um, variations on induction. Find with proof all values of n such that 2 to the n is less than or equal to n factorial. Suppose you have a pencil that's 20 centimeters long and a pencil sharpener that can take off either 3 centimeters or 5 centimeters at a time. What possible lengths can you make your pencil? And this is a variation on the n squared is less than or equal to 2 to the n example. But instead of n squared, we're looking at n cubed, n to the 4, n to the 5. So show that for all exponents k in the natural numbers, there is this starting index, this base case number n, such that n to the k is less than 2 to the n for all natural numbers that are bigger than that base. Now let's take some time to reflect. What are the two things you can modify about simple induction? Is there a variation on induction to prove something about all negative integers? Is there a variation on induction to prove something about all positive multiples of 5? Thank you very much and have a great day.